guys, this is Luna's Cross, and I've just finished opening my Elite Trainer Box of Unified Minds, and now I'm on to my first booster of two. So hopefully I could get some of the awesome, wonderfully beautiful tag team cards, because they're really the star of this, this pack. Like, they're gorgeous and I really want them and I didn't do very well with my elite trainer box so hopefully I can get some really awesome ones here and in this one too so let's take a look um, looks pretty nice it has the teams on it They're just so cool. The four that are featured on the packs are featured here. So let's open it up. Please open. The cards inside. Oh my god. No, don't break. Don't break. Don't break under the force of this. Come on. Okay. It's almost open. <laughs> Here we are. Away with you. So, once again, Great minds work in unity. Let's try that again. To stay on top, your team must work as one new tag team Pokemon GX. Battle in flawless harmony in the Pokemon TCG Sun and Moon Unified Minds expansion, including Mewtwo and Mew, Rowlet and Alolan Executor, Espeon and Deoxys, uh, Garchomp and Giratina, and um, Brion and Darkrai, which again, I want that one, but next one's more. Um, and more. True teamwork, take aim at a single goal. Find your perfect partner in the Sun and Moon Unifying Minds expansion. <gasps> so. Oh, that's wonderful. So wonderful. Okay, so I figure. I guess I'll see, maybe breaking it up so that we'll do eight, just like an elite trainer box. That way each of these parts isn't too freaking long. So, the first quarter of this one booster. Hopefully, it has lots of tag teams in it. Let's get going. Oh, oh, I wasn't thinking and I ripped it so much. Thank God the front is okay. Ah, oh, no, I keep ripping it. Okay, so let's try not to see the code card. Oh. What? So, apparently, this code card is facing the other way versus how the Elite was. So I guess we'll be safe and not see the color if I do it normally. Um, so yeah, <laughs> this one I, I messed up on, but whatever, I guess. Um, not a good start, but hopefully what's in this pack will be. So let us see. A fairy energy. Goodbye, Tauros. That actually looks kind of cool. It would be pretty cool as a hollow. Much luck. Oh. Snowbird. Mercurio, looks cute. 
Bloom and Grimer. That hoot hoot again. Scraggy. And. Ah! Ah! <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my god. Slowpoke and Psyduck. GX. Full art. It's. It's beautiful. They're both so dopey and I love it. Let's see what they do. So they have an HP of 250, Ditch and Splash. Uh, 40 times, discard any number of support cards from your hand. This attack does 40 damage for each card you discard in this way. And Thrilling Times is its GX move. <laughs> it's wonderful. And uh, 10 plus. Flip a coin. If heads, this attack does 100 more damage. If this Pokemon has at least 6 extra um, water energy attached to it, in addition to this attack's cost, so we would need 8. Uh, flip 10 coins instead, and this attack does 100 more damage for each heads. Wow. So... Yeah, like, that could do a lot, depending on your luck with flipping coins. But, <laughs> like, look at it. I love it. So it kind of has, like, it's not the wavy hollow like the others. It's kind of like a um, stained glass crystallized look to the hollow where it's kind of like shattered glass kind of thingness with that like wonderful texture. Oh, it's just so awesome. <laughs> so yeah, that was that was a good start. My first tag team. Yeah, like the last time I opened Pokemon cards, tag team Pokemon cards wasn't a thing. So I'm quite a few packs um, behind. Um, but yeah, this is this is a nice first one. <laughs> so yeah, this is, this is going well. Let's go to the next. Does this one hold true? Does this one hold true? <gasps> yes, good. The code card is facing me, so I won't see its color, which is really great. Because just knowing that it's a good or a bad one right from the start just isn't that great. Because I expect, well, I hope for all of them to be great and to know right off the bat if it is or not, it's, that just sucks. So, water energy. Oh my god. Normalinium Z tackle. Oh, what the hell is this? What? If the Pokemon this card is attached to it has the tackle attack, it can use the GX attack on this card. Oh my god, it does 200 plus. Oh, oh my god. This is insane. Flip a coin until you get tails. This attack does 40 more damage for each heads on top of 200. It's insane. I wonder what the highest... HP Pokemon that knows Tackle is. Because you most likely will get one, maybe two hits before it is absolutely pulverized. But you would probably do massive damage. So that, that's pretty awesome. Haku. Slaka. Oh, I freaking hate this. 
Pokemon. So stupid. Onyx. <laughs> Sneaky. The reverse is Purloin and uh, this guy. Six Tree again. So, so far the duplicates aren't too horrendous, but I'm absolutely positive I have not gotten all of the like commons for this set yet. It definitely seems that some are showing up a lot compared to others. Doesn't want that to Denny. It's really cute. Again, the blade reverse and <gasps> Umbreon and Darkrai GX tag team. It is really pretty. <laughs> okay, so it has 270 HP, and its first move is Black. Lance, which does 150. This attack does 6 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon GX or bench Pokemon EX. Oh! It's just straight up. Wow, that's really good for 3 energy. Um, and Dark Moon GX. Uh, your opponent can't play any Pokemon... Oh, blah, 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 blah. Your opponent can't play any trainer cards from their hand during their next turn. If this Pokemon has at least five extra um, dark energy attached to it, in addition to this attack's cost, your opponent's active Pokemon is knocked out. That's pretty nice. You would need a lot of a lot of energy, but to just instant KO it. That's really nice. And it is really pretty. Ooh. Yeah, the shine of it just looks really pretty, especially with his eye. Well, dark eyes eye, because he's technically just not a guy or a girl, but whatever. And oh yeah, and um, Umbreon's eye is also, but it's not as noticeable. Oh, it's so nice. So we have five more to go. <laughs> oh, oh no, recover, recover from the rip. Oh my god, wait. See if I could get another one. So electric energy. Miss Spritz. Oh, it's in such a pretty place. Koala. Oh sorry, Komola. Uh, Pokemon Research Lab. Bone Edge. Magnemite. Fletching. Onyx. Fletch in there. Rather can't reverse and non hollow toxic books. Let's 
so we're halfway now and we're doing really well for this at least section of this booster. And hopefully that didn't jinx me. Psychic. Hair cross. Type no. Oh, so far all of these have been new. Steamy. Jetini. Bonkus. Cone Edge. Never mind, I take it back. Sneasel. Megamite. Reverse Dynamo. And. Ooh, Heatran GX. That's pretty nice. And once again, kind of the like ripply hollow. So, Burning Road. Once during your turn, when this Pokemon moves from your bench to become your active Pokemon, you may move any number of fire energy from your other Pokemon to it. All right, so you could like stack it up right away. Um, steaming stomp does 130. No description, just straight to the point. And hot burn GX uh, 50 times. So this attack does 50 damage times the amount of fire energy attached to this Pokemon. So I guess like if you move it from your bench to be active, move all the energy you possibly have and then using your GX move, that would be pretty awesome. Yay! Okay. Next one. Yeah, like, on the entire bus ride home, which it wasn't too long considering, but still, I was smiling so much because it's been such a long time since I've opened Pokemon cards. And unlike Dex, who every now and then gets some and then just opens them off camera, I don't do that. So what you see in our reviews is exactly what I have. So. Fire energy. Ugh. I wish Tynamo didn't evolve into these guys. Like, I know they're supposed to be strong, but they're just not. I don't like them. Tynamo is just so cute and amazing as it's. Electric. Ah, they did it again. Lurantis. Bone Edge. Magnite. Fletch Ming, Onyx, Flesh Cinder, Reverse of Valley, which is actually pretty. And, oh, a Hollow Angie Slash. Not quite the same rippling as much. There's a tiny bit, but it looks more spread out, I guess. It's pretty nice. So two more. Did it okay? Oh my god. Oh my god, come on. Grass energy. Drink you. 
Lecture. Reset stamp. Your opponent shuffles their hand into their deck and draws a card for each of their remaining prize cards. Hmm. Cryogonal, or however you say it. <gasps> Another nitpick. It's so cute. Jello, drill, burr, or whatever. Slap cloth, fingers. Noi bat reverse, and it's real cute. And. <gasps> His eyes are still shiny, like the others have been, but it looks like it's kind of following more of a grass-like texture to go with the background, I guess. It's really nice. And last one for this first quarter of the first booster. My cheeks hurt. Oh, well, screw it. Here you go. Hopefully, it gives you good stuff. She's me. Much likes. The reset stamp. Yang goose. Yan ma. It's cute. Micro. Snover. This monkey guy again in the first ant. Uh, Novern non hollow once again. So, for the first quarter of this booster, <laughs> it was really good. with one hollow, one full art trainer, which is the one I wanted most of all the trainers or supports. So yeah, um, GX full art and two of the beautiful tag teams. Neither of which were the ones I was really aiming for but they're still awesome. So yeah, this this first quarter was great, and I really hope this like awesome luck continues. So yeah, bye. <laughs>